All right, my friends, welcome back to the channel. Please like, comment, subscribe, and hit that notification button as I continue to bring you weekly content. And today, other than Transformers, I think we should take a look at the Ghostbusters Plasma series. And as always, we'll take a quick look at the packaging. See, Ghostbusters right there. Ghostbusters sign right there. Spingler. We're just going to take a look at just Spingler box because all of them are exactly the same. And of course, this side of the box, you got a picture of all four Ghostbusters. This side of the box, not much happening. By the box. The same thing, not much happening. Legal mumbo jumbo. UPC code right there. Body body blah. Top of the box. Nothing happening there. Back of the box. You just got your product shots of the Ghostbusters. And of course, once you get all six of them, they form the dog for one of the dogs from the first one. Which is really, really cool. So you just more legal legal mumbo jumbo and all that good stuff. Don't eat, body body blah. And that's basically it for the packaging. And here is a look at all four of the Ghostbusters. I haven't got the other two yet. Not really too worried about it. I know they're dirt cheap right now at Walmart, but hey, I really like the uh, the detailing on this. So articulation, head is on a ball joint, can't do a full 360. And his arms do move up and down. His legs can't do the splits too. Articulation will be the same for all four of them. And of course you got the port back there to put their proton packs in. All four of them will come with the Proton Pack. We'll get to that a little bit later. And now for comparison, here they are with the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, the comic book version of themselves. As you see, the Ghostbusters are much taller than what they are. Alrighty, let's go ahead and now take a look at what they'll look like with their Proton Packs on. All right, here's what they look like with their proton packs on. The only issue is that they will have trouble standing, standing upright. Right here is Egon, rest in peace. What he looks like. And of course, you put them on top of his head. They go down, just like in the movie. So I think that's pretty cool. And of course, here he is with the he is with his ray gun, the proton pack. Here's what it looks like with the proton pack on the back. You see, they can't really, they won't really want to stand up right unless you have something holding hold them on the back. And here is Ray. Very, very nicely done. I do like, I do like how they did them. They just got to get them to stand a little bit better. So I guess apparently the Diamond Select one with uh, Bill Murray's character there, I guess they didn't, uh, make his pants baggy, which that stuff doesn't really bother me that much. So, which I will, will be looking forward to seeing the next Ghostbusters film, Afterlife, on uh, HBO Max, I think is supposed to come out next year. I think movie theaters are dead now because of the because of the stupid virus. So, anyways, that's pretty much a quick review of what the Ghostbusters Plasma series looks like with all four of them. And yeah, uh, just make sure you like, comment, subscribe. I'm always doing contests. I'm going to be doing a contest uh, winner at the beginning, the very beginning in March and for spring. And yeah, thanks for coming and have a great day. Please subscribe.